and the bluebells is nearly dead. I hope you can hear the fucking birds singing mine, but I doubt it. Ah. No public access. There you go. I don't know whether I got the squirrel on camera there. But there's a fucking grey just run across in front of me. Um, and there's people coming up the path behind me so I'm obviously going to have to stay out of their way best I can so that they don't wowl on at me can you hear a pheasant? there's one about Whether the camera's picking that up there. Well, there's a little road there. And there's bluebells lying on either side of it. Um, yeah, quite pretty. But I think I've left it a bit too late for the vast majority of them. About eight weeks too late, I would imagine. Eight weeks of fucking being locked in shitty houses because lion cunts said there was a nasty disease. Oh dear. I don't think on today's little adventure mine we're going to see very many animals because of the small child that was running around shouting echo at the top of its fucking voice. Yeah. But, echo. For all you fuckers that stuck in your fucking house for eight weeks, or however long it's been now, today, big one for a walk. Bluebells. I didn't imagine it. They actually exist. They're a bit dead now. <laughs> but so is 31,000 other people. Yeah. I should really have bolted my court my camera onto my phone. Why is this? No public access. Get a life, you fucking sad bastards. Fucking multi million pound corporation owns a fucking wood and you can't go walk about in it. Dickhead.
Well, I don't know whether you've seen the blackbird there, but that's a blackbird and a squirrel. We're not doing bad. There is some life in the woods after all. Happy days. Big, tall, fucking trees. And that best text message I got while walking through the woods is fucking annoying. Oh, there you go. As you can probably hear, we're coming up to the thin side of the woods here, and like there's a sheep field not much further beyond. Um, we'll walk down to it because like I have nothing better to do and I've never been out the house in eight weeks and my feet are bleeding so yeah it'll all be lovely well in fact not many bluebells to see there's some sheep, and it's not even whales. Meh, <laughs> brown sauce. Looks rather splendid. I don't know whether the camera's even picking it up, but there you go. We're going to walk down to the bottom half, right? then I'll turn my camera off. Because you've had your little adventure, I've had my little adventure. And that must be a tree that's marked to chop down. Don't know why, because it looks rather healthy. But, I can see the mark on it. Well, it's ready to go. Well, that one looks better. Does this one have a sign saying no public as well? I might even put a link in to this so you can see why no public access actually it doesn't so we might be able to go for a mooch down that one next because if it doesn't have a sign then it's mine <laughs> Here we go. We've reached the far side of the woods. Um, and if you've enjoyed it so far, then just hang around. There's a fucking crow. They won't fly near my house. I don't know why. Yeah, that's where the witches live. Do you believe me? You should. I'm insane. Just like England, look, rubbish dump. 
bottle of hide on the floor. No way to put it, so it'll have to stay there for the time being. But uh, because you've hung around with me so far, this is your reward. Yeah, that's a kind of reward. This is your view from the up the side of the woods. Um, <laughs> it's fairly panoramic. And that there is Ravy Castle. Um, but you can see Bo's Moor over as far as Wreath from here. So, yeah, it's not a bad little view, is it really? And Jonas is wondering what I'm doing here. She doesn't like me. I think it's too hot for them ones there, but there you go. Hope you've enjoyed it, folks. Fucking bastard camera. That there <laughs> is the road to the other castle. Um, I have a fucking sneaky suspicion that they don't want you in there for some reason. Might be due to the padlocks and things like that. But if you feel like an adventure with me tomorrow, and just speak up. But for the time being, we're going over there for another little adventure. Yeah. There you go. Merry Christmas. <laughs>